episode of Super Reaction Bros. I'm Chris. And I'm Christopher. And on today's episode, we're taking a look at the official trailer for the Fresh Prince of Bel Air reunion. Uh, this is a documentary done featuring the return of the, pretty much the entire the, the OG cast, the, the OG original, cast. original cast from the original show. Um, and, and Will Smith, it's, it's he's been all over it and everything. Like said, uh, this from the start of this it looks like from the start of this trailer it looks like he's all over this, bringing everybody together and stuff like that. Um, yeah, yes. sadly, the old, of course, the only one that obviously could not make it was James Avery, who passed away, I think, last year or the year before. Yeah, and the they did, played yeah, the yeah, they did, they did do, like, uh, through, like, a live stream, they pretty much, you know, kind of did, like, a reunion, but it was through a live stream instead, through, like, this, But this appears to be, like, them They're together. in person, all together, um, but they did, they did do, like, for James Avery, they did do a video where, like, in, memor in memoriam of, of, of him. Mm -hmm. And stuff like that. But here it's like they're physically all together and stuff like that. And yeah, we'll be able to talk a lot more uh, after this. Let's just dive right into this. Uh, into the official trailer for the Fresh Prince of Bel-Air reunion. So here we go. You've probably seen the picture, me with the whole Fresh Prince cast. Hold on, the lights off a little bit. You probably seen it. <laughs> posted it uh, uh, about a month ago, me and the whole Fresh Prince cast. But you're not ready for this trailer. You couldn't be ready for this trailer. <laughs> That's Happy Will for you. You're welcome, Will. Thank you, Will. You're welcome. Thank you, Will. Yes, you're welcome, Will. That's cool. The original. Look at the the set. The original set. How crazy is it walking in here? <laughs> he is upstairs. I've always been able to recognize chemistry. Will and Alfonso from the very beginning were just playmates. This is my brother Carlton. He knows we can't afford any bigger clothes, so he just doesn't grow. <laughs> <laughs> And you could. <laughs> I had no aspirations to have. Just turn down the show. He eats well. Will is very good at talking me in with things. They said, I want to do a vision for this new sitcom with a rapper. I said, oh, pass. Pass. With a rapper. Nope, pass. Tape night was special. It was just kind of like a Friday night party. We each grabbed percussion instruments. Oh, yeah, no, no. Like, every show has, like, a tradition that they do. It was the hottest ticket in town, as they called it. James was the heart of the show. James Avery was this six foot four Shakespearean beast. And I wanted him to think I was good. Uh, you don't want me, man. I fall into his arms at the end of God the damn, that's still good. That scene still gets me. And the shot pans off, and he whispered in my ear, Now that's acting. I didn't realize how many people we were reaching. There will always be a piece of all of us in that living room. Our show meant black excellence to people. The excellence was the way that we loved each other. I couldn't celebrate 30 years of Fresh Prince without Jack. Oh, oh, they got her as well. Cool. Hey, this, this yeah, they, they, I, I don't. I forgot Hawaii, but yeah, they switch. The only thing. And, and they went a bit meta in the following episode where one of them were like, wait, you don't look... It's like, did you stop that with your hair? So yeah, that looks horrible. I definitely yeah. wouldn't mind checking that out. Yeah, he's only, and of course, he's only doing this only because since um, now they're oh, trying to... don't get me started on that shit. <laughs> Do not get me started on that bullshit. Like, I love the original series, but major series work was, not only was it a sitcom, but it was a, such an important message to the, not only the African American community, but it was such a great, fun I don't know. drama I mean, to I'm, it as I'm, I'm, I'm excited for it. And for those who don't know what we're talking about, is that, um, cause a fan, a fan did a fan film of like, what if Fresh Prince was like, at, you know, like more of like a setup as a drama type of thing, you know, set up, I mean, you could probably find, find it somewhere online, stuff like that. And it caught the attention of Will, of Will Smith, and that's when he's like, I guess after talks and talks, they're now finally deciding, okay, they're gonna start developing an actual like more of a dr drama type of series uh, for it, you know, more of a serious uh, a series, uh, you know, from it, you know, that's what they're doing. I'm excited for it only because it's like there's I'm aspects to it. it, there's aspects to it where I'm like, okay, they're taking it more serious, especially with everything going on nowadays. It's like. 
it's taking a more of a, a serious tone with it, what's going on, everything, because it did change a lot of. I you know, just was a, don't a think it needs to be a drama. That's it's not that fact. It, it, it doesn't need to have a lot because the original did have its dramatic really dramatic moments like we saw in there but it just making it a priority a, a drama it just doesn't feel right you know it just I don't know it doesn't feel I, right I think, I think it's a good thing pretty much because like I said it's like it's taking it more of a serious take on it and then you know then more of like oh you know it's like everybody's laughing about every little thing you know it's like here it's like you still gonna probably have you know small little funny moments that you would remember from the show maybe but the rest of it is just more of like, you know, it's like how serious it was. Because if you look at the story, there was a... Because I watched the video pretty much when they sat down and, and talked to the guy, the, fa- the the actual people that made the, the fan film and stuff like that. And even they said when they were putting the script together, it started off as a drama. They added the comedy because the, the, the studio at the time asked for it because they're like, we need more, you know, black comedy and stuff like that. So it's like, they, that's when they just add, start adding, you know, made it more of like a sitcom type of, type of show. And even they said some of the, the original writers are like are happy to come back because now they get to write it the way you know they really wanted to write it you know with the drama and things like that. Oh yeah, so. oh yeah, on see on that. Like I said, I'm just not a fan. Of, yeah, I, and like I said, I'm not. I'm not trying to pu- push you over. Everybody's gonna have their own. No, no, that's what I'm trying to get to. Is that everybody will have their own opinion because some people grew up watching the show and some of them just wanna wanna stick to the sitcom than more of the drama. They want something to watch funny and things like that. Some of them just don't want it. So, but what I, does that to see? But I am looking forward to checking this documentary out. Already. Yeah, same here. So, so other than that... Remember. So, other than that, if you're new to the channel, you can hit the like button. If you want to talk to us more about stuff like this, comment down below. If you want to share us around, share it around. And if you like us just a little bit more than anybody else when it comes to talking about HBO Max original documentaries, hit the subscribe button down below and hit that bell icon as well. It said the date, right? I'll look it up. Let's okay. go on. Uh, let us know what you guys thought of this trailer uh, for uh, the reunion. What are you excited for? You, you can't wait to see some of these uh, uh, characters, you know, or at least these actors all coming, the cast, the original cast coming back. You know, are you excited to see them all return to see, you know, memory, them remember, having big memories, stuff like that. Um, you know, what, what was your you know favorite moment in the original series? What drew you into the original series itself for the sitcom? Um, and like I said before, like about the the upcoming you know drama remake for it. Are you excited for it? You know, are you do you want to see how it turns out, or or it's just a full on pass? You just don't want to watch it. You know, you you you'd rather just stick to the sitcom what you grew up with. Let us know in the comments down below. Put down what you thought of our reaction overall, but most importantly. Thank you for watching. November 19th. So until next time, I'm Kristen. I'm Christopher. And this has been a very fresh Princefield episode of SRB. See ya. Later. Hey guys, thanks for watching. If you want to check out our previous reactions. Or any one of our other SRB shows. Check out one of our playlists down below. And if you want to check us out in the social universe. You can find us on Twitter. And Stardust. At Super React Bros.